In the next segment, we would like to ask you about campus life. Yes. What is your experience of campus life at Waseda? And how is the experience of living in Japan? My most memorable experience in Japan is not about studying, but it is Japanese peoples and cultures. Although my Japanese skill is limited, with the support from professors, peers, and staff, I could overcome a lot of challenges more easily than I think. I am very impressed with the way Japanese people respect other people's personal space, their levels of service, and how they try to keep their city clean. Uh, I think this is something that international people, both living in and outside Japan, trying to learn from the Japanese. One of interesting things that interests me a lot is the phrase Osukale Sama. I hear it everywhere, at the university, at the seminars, at the greetings, after something is done, and even at a goodbye. When I and my colleagues are talking about our own dealing with a difficult task, my Japanese friends usually say Osukare sama to me and each other, meaning that our effort and time are recognized and appreciated. Similarly, they usually say it at the end of the workday uh, to show each other support. I think this is an interesting matrix that creates a good relationship and helps everyone respect each other in the Japanese society. So, Mom, um, you are engaging graduate study, but at the same time, you are learning Japanese. And Japanese is really uh, advancing. So you don't mix up three languages in your head? Yeah. <laughs> you do? <laughs> How do you overcome that? Uh, I think this is our practices. I think if they, if we uh, have an opportunity to use it every day, say to sensei with a Japanese, with our friends in Japanese, and I say speak with my family in Thai, and sometimes I need to write in English dissertation in English. So I need to practice and try to change the language and uh, create a sentence for the suitable situations in different situations in Japanese. Good, thank you very much. Uh, next, maybe I would like to ask Shi Chen about your experience of living in Japan. Well, Japan is indeed a great place to live. You know, Tokyo is the most uh, business city in the world, so you can uh, literally do anything here. Actually, I live in an urban area in Tokyo and I go to the classes twice a week. Uh, actually, Tokyo is also an international city, so you can find many foreigner communities here. I live in a Chinese community. Uh, I found that is a place can help me to get used to uh, a new life, a new place. And besides social uh, convenience, Japan is also a country with a beautiful scenery, scenery with a distinct uh, for season. You can enjoy in the red maple in autumn and the cherry blossom in spring. That's really beautiful. That's good to know. And uh, I, I heard that you went to Kyoto this weekend. Tell me about your experience of visiting Kyoto. Actually, Kyoto is a city different to Tokyo because Kyoto is a city with many history streets. Um, so you can enjoy many many old many Japanese culture that place. Kyoto or Tokyo, which city do you prefer to live? Absolutely, I prefer Tokyo. Oh, okay, that was a trick <laughs> question because I'm from <laughs> Kyoto area. <laughs> <laughs> but that's good, <laughs> because I'm living in Tokyo right now. Yeah. Glad to have you in Edix program. <laughs> yes. Next, Kanji, tell me about your experience of studying at the academic program here. Yes. Uh, I actually, I enjoy the campus life. And Waseda University has many international students. Uh, therefore, we can learn each other from uh, similar culture background um, in our field of specialization. So as a result, uh, we can get professional knowledge uh, on a daily basis. Thank you.